and welcome. This year's annual awards are of course very different to those that we've done in previous years and I'm sorry that we're not able to celebrate the awards more appropriately this year. Celebrating the success of, of our students is something that we very much value and is something that the college is passionate about. And as ever, this past 15 months, there's been some incredible successes with no more than 12 students receiving offers to go to Oxbridge this September and 15 students receiving goals in various world skills competitions in Wales this last 12 months. Tonight, you're going to meet students from across the wide and ever increasing range of college provision from full time A level students and vocational students to apprentices to employability clients delivered from our provision in the Kingsway to higher education students from part time adults and our ever increasing range of a number of international students. Every one of them is an outstanding story of what can be achieved with commitment, dedication and hard work with the support of the staff at the college. And I congratulate each and every one of the students and give my thanks to all the staff, both teaching and support staff, for everything they've done this year in making these students' dreams come true. Very soon we will be returning to college and continuing to support many thousands of others moving forward. And we'll do that at the same time as introducing new courses and a new range of facilities such as our new business school down in Sketty Hall. And I look forward to seeing you then to work with another group of students to make their dreams come true. So this evening, ladies and gentlemen, relax, sit back and enjoy. You deserve it. Hi to everyone at Gower College Swansea. I am really disappointed that we can't be together at the Liberty Stadium tonight for the awards ceremony that we've all enjoyed in recent years and enjoyed that three course meal. Sorry to rub it in, but you are going to have a fantastic night. Good luck and congratulations to all the students who have been honoured this evening for their hard work and graft over the past few years. Congratulations to you, congratulations to all the staff and of course congratulations to your families who must be incredibly proud of each and every one of you. It'll be a great event next year, but tonight is a special event for you. Enjoy it. Many congratulations. Well done, Diane. Sometimes in our lives we all have pain, we all have sorrow, but if we
reason I chose the student was because of their dedication to the course. Back four years ago, when they came to us, they found it difficult to fill in a form. They were sent to us by communities for work in Port Mead, and I've continued every week to turn up to class, coming in on their push bike, come rain or shine, they're there. They initially, they found filling in the forms very hard to do. However, recently they have filled in a job application form themselves and sent it off and gained a post at the local school as a caretaker. I found this quite inspirational of what this student has done due to the hardship they found in initially when they came to us. I've nominated the students as I felt she deserves to be recognised and rewarded for her perseverance and persistence and commitment to this course. Always completing her work to the highest standard, along with an excellent attendance record. Although she's had a difficult few years, she never feels sorry for herself and always puts the welfare of others before her own. She's focused, highly motivated, a fabulous role model to her peers and a beautiful student to teach. I'm pleased that she has won this award and I would like to say a huge congratulations. It's a great pleasure to nominate this student for the award from Travel and Tourism. The words that you would associate with this student are determined, enthusiastic, motivated, but also resilient because the last couple of years have thrown up lots of challenges and this student has faced up to each and every one of them, overcome them and been successful. It's been a real pleasure to witness the growth in her maturity and understanding of what she needs to do to be successful. This award is really thoroughly deserved and we wish her all the best. I nominated this student for the excellent progress they've made with their college studies and their social skills. When the student first enrolled at the college, they found it very difficult to communicate with staff and students through their own hard work and determination, they've overcome several barriers, which has given them the confidence to apply to study a level one hairdressing course at the college. Well done, we're very proud of what you achieved this year and wish you all the best for your future career. I nominate this young lady for many reasons. Academically, she's been excellent, often being ahead of the game in all her lectures. She's also a wonderful netball player, being a valued member of the college team and has international orders at many age groups. Also in her own time, she's been very unselfish. She's travelled to Nepal, where she's helped the earthquake victims. And she's also travelled to Poland, her homeland, to help with underprivileged people. In summary, there are three areas. Academically, she has excelled. She's flourished on the netball court and helped people less fortunate than herself. She's very worthy of this prize and I wish her well in the future. None of us know how we'll react to particular circumstances, but this student knows only too well how to cope with emotional challenges from a very young age and get on with it. She embraces her studies, she's realised that her future can be bright and exciting and she wants to make her family proud. I for one am very proud of this student as I am of all my students and I'm glad that she's been recognised for her ability, creativity imagination and particularly her feistiness which I think has a lot to do with me. So <laughs> congratulations, long of well done. This 
student epitomises the very best of our students and as both his lecturer and his tutor I've had the pleasure of knowing him for the last two years. He's a student who makes a worthy contribution to his studies and to his relationship with his peers. Whilst his academic achievements are noteworthy, he also has an outstanding work ethic. He's driven to succeed and demonstrated the virtue of being a good citizen by simply volunteering at a local charitable organisation, local aid in Gorsainen. In the first instance, he's had to overcome multiple challenges to come to college and he's maintained full attendance over the last two years. He's well respected by all and he's considered as a positive, perceptive person. He's a valued student and being highly ambitious and determined to succeed, he's a positive role model for all. I wish him every success at university. This student has just completed an extended diploma in theatre production arts with an outstanding 100% attendance throughout. As a stage manager, this student has worked at many college productions and events and is well respected by both his peers and staff, always been so positive and supportive. After gaining unconditional offers at some of the most prestigious drama colleges in the UK, this student has accepted a place at the renowned Bristol Old Vic Theatre School. I, along with staff from the production and performing arts team, would like to wish him every success for the future. I look forward to seeing the very exciting and rewarding opportunities that a career in theatre production arts can bring. I decided to nominate this learner from a pool of very bright, committed students because she not only has shown all these qualities, but an incredible mindset and resilience. She's enthusiastic and hardworking. She produces excellent work. Her linguistic knowledge is remarkable. She achieved a grade A in her AS exams last year as a result of her hard work, tenacity and resilience. It is for these reasons that I did not hesitate in nominating her. It is an achievement for a student to fast track A-level psychology and to be accepted by a university within five months. It is extraordinary when this university is Cambridge. This student is described by his lecturers as intellectually flexible with an insatiable thirst for psychological knowledge. And he has attended the HE Plus masterclasses and extensions offered to him within college in order to do just this with his, with his understanding of psychology. He will gain so much from his studies of psychology at Cambridge and in return he will give so much to the subject and to the university. I've nominated this student because of the mark he's left on the department after two years of study. He's been a superb role model to his peers, always encouraging them to go beyond the course content to further enhance their own knowledge and understanding of computing. Such was his influence, we invited him to be both mentor and trainer to students taking part in the 2020 Skills Challenges. He himself had already won a silver medal and a gold medal in 2019 and was looking to go even further in 2020. At the end of the course, he's expected to achieve a triple distinction star in the BTEC Extended Diploma and also has been integral to the very successful GCSL's eSports team. Hello everyone, I've nominated this person for Engineering Student of the Year due to his professionalism and excellent attitude towards his studies and his caring nature for his family and children. 
he has had to balance looking after his wife and children throughout his studies. He moved from the Lebanon to Swansea in 2015, where he studied ESOL language courses and at TCO completed his level one and level two in vehicle maintenance and repair. He then joined the VRQ3 in Gosainan and has made excellent progress, caring for his peers and acting with great professionalism. I have nominated this student because of her hard work and commitment. She jo joined childcare three years ago at level two. She was quiet and lacked confidence and self-belief. But she's since completed level three and more recently the extended diploma. She never fussed about the workload, just got on, got on quietly and studiously. She proved to be a very competent nursery nurse and her setting spoke highly of her abilities. If I had told her three years ago she would be applying to university, she would never have believed me. We as the department are very proud of her dedication in completing all three courses successfully and we wish her all the best for her future studies and her future career. The winning plumbing student has already attained the level 1 diploma in plumbing and now the level 2 diploma in access to building studies. From all the plumbing team, we wish this person the very best for the future. Dayan Pobluk. started her learning journey with us at level two when she was new to housing, having previously worked in hospitality. From the very beginning, it was clear that she had such drive and determination not only to achieve the qualification, but to progress within her new career. And since completing the qualification, she has had the confidence to apply for new positions and secured an secondment within her organisation and is doing fantastic. DBLA has been nominated by various individuals and departments from across the college for the Employer Partner of the Year Award. We have a really good relationship with the DBLA, one that's been cultivated over 10 years and from 2015 we've started delivering a friendship provision for them. From 2015 to last year we had 52 apprentices. We now have 50 apprentices with the DBLA currently. That's from a range of different areas and frameworks from contact centre operations, information advice and guidance, business administration, customer services. We also deliver IT web and telecoms, data analytics, and we're undertaking and partnering on a really innovative programme by a digital learning design framework, which you see in the college upskill, the DVLA's user experience team. It's a relationship that continues to go from strength to strength. The partnership is becoming more deep rooted and I'm really looking forward to seeing what we can achieve in the next few years. This learner was very apprehensive about beginning her apprenticeship. As she progressed, she engaged with the qualification and I could see it's in the workplace that she truly excels. She will say she's just doing her job role, but in reality, she does so much more. She's a real unsung hero who makes a tremendous difference to people's lives without realising the impact she has. She cares about each and every one of her tenants and goes way beyond the scope of her job description. This learner has made exceptional progress and I hope this award will encourage her to recognise just how far she has come. Diane T, congratulations. I've 
nominated this student because she's a great ambassador for the college. Always polite, with an infectious smile and a determination to succeed. She represented the college at the Senior Maths Challenge in London last year and was awarded a silver medal for the Senior Maths Challenge this year. She manages all four A-level subjects with passion and commitment and always strives to do her best in whatever she does. She has received fantastic offers for Edinburgh and Cardiff to study architecture. Good luck and congratulations on being International Student of the Year. I am extremely proud to nominate this student for this award this year. She is one of a kind. She's turned many negatives into a positive. She's always helping other students. She's supportive, kind, nurturing, and she does all this in front of a backdrop of her own personal issues. When you talk to other members of staff, they all say the same thing, that she's diligent, determined, and committed to the course. And I'm really pleased that I had the chance to nominate her. Well done. I nominated this student as she manages the commitment of a full-time course and balance in a busy home life with incredible enthusiasm and dedication. Since joining the FDA Fashion and Textile Design course, she's been an outstanding student. Faced with some personal challenges, it's never hindered her ability to produce outstanding work and attend every lecture. Her attitude and commitment and devotion to her project work is exemplary. She's often in the studio before I arrive in the morning and is very often last out of the door at the end of the day. Her passion and drive for her work is reflected in the grades she's achieved across both years one and two and is on target to graduate this year with a distinction grade overall, equivalent to a first class degree. She's an asset to not only her family, the course, but the college as a whole. She has an admirable work ethic that will stand her in good stead for her future endeavours. Well, I'm a very man with you need Kavraniad Shelwithol Yer Gamraig, Eris Karay the Mang or Signon. Um, my hin Dilanores talent dog. See the widdy Kai like Alu Hwara, my Nivero, big with the Ade and a colleague, seen Vathli Kamri, Athrith Tadith Kamri, save Duarnod Shumai, Deeth Music Kamri, a Deeth Gul Dewi. My hin Kangrehiolir colleague, Arasluivan Genid Lethol, Bel e nor Dylanorion and Gerdorva Genid Lethol Pridae. Fel Kinvivarur Ascol Gymraig Ys Dylavera, Cymraig yw ei hiaith gyntaf. Bi'n rhoi'r darlleniad nadolig yng Ngwasanoeth Carolau yr Advent yn y coleg yn mis rhagfyr. A mae hi'n fyfyrwyr anhunanol ac mae bob amser yn mynd allon o'i ffordd i gynrychiolu'r coleg pan fo angen. Cystadlodd yn rheolaidd yn eisteddfodau'r urth, ac mae hefyd yn biannydd talentog sydd wedi cyfeilu'r cwr mewn perfformiadau amrywiol. Rwy'n credu'r gryf ei bod yn haidd i cael ei hysteried ar gyfer awobr Gymraeg Eleni. Llong gyfarchiadau fel. This individual has been nominated for the Gower College Swansea Student Awards of 2020 because they have shown tremendous dedication to overcome a number of barriers they faced. They truly are an inspirational role model for all others to follow. So on behalf of the team at the Employability Department, we wish you the very best of luck and we hope you win.
September, Liz Shun came to me and asked me if she could be a GCS Active Ambassador, and it was a no-brainer. She has a group of BAME students who meet once a week to play games, learn new sports, and most importantly, have fun together. The group have seen numbers rise since it started, and it is only through her hard work and dedication that it's continued to grow. She has recently won the Volunteer of the Year Award at Swansea Sports Awards, along with being honoured the Young Activist of the Year at the prestigious Sport Gives Back Award ceremony held in London. She has a great passion, attitude and commitment to learning, but we all know where her heart lies, and that is giving others the opportunity to enjoy sport and physical activity as much as she does. Hello, I'm delighted this learner has been selected as a Progression and Commitment Student of the Year. They have overcome a lot of challenges outside of college and embark on an epic journey each day to and from college, travelling over 60 miles. Whilst in college, they show great desire, commitments, enthusiasm, peer teaching, great team worker. This learner has overcome so much in such a short space of time and I am delighted that they have been selected for this award, bearing in mind this learner is still at school and is only 14 years of age, so they are a credit to themselves, their school and college. And I am proud to work for a college that puts its learners at the heart of everything that it does. Thank you. Well, you've now met all of our outstanding students for this year, and I hope you agree that they're an incredible group of students. Every year we have one final award, what we call our Inspirational Student of the Year Award, a student story that stands out from others, even though it was an incredibly high standard this year. The judges had a particularly difficult decision. This made there were so many incredible stories. But after a long discussion, we felt that one student stood out. A student who had the tenacity to deal with so many challenges that have been thrown his way during his young life, his dedication to his studies and to his family, and his outstanding academic achievement. A truly inspirational student and a remarkable young yeah. man.